All right, guys, uh, what's up? Welcome to the channel. I know I've been out for a couple of weeks on these videos. And uh, just to be honest, man, I've just had to get some personal stuff figured out, man, in my life and family and balancing. And, you know, as business owners, y'all, we just... <sighs> I'm an ex-drug addict, man. So either I'm extreme in one area and the other area falls to the side. So a balance is really hard for me. <clears throat> so I've just had to, you know, kind of get my life balanced out, man. Figure some things out. And get back on pace. Get back on, on what, what's important, you know, which is family. Uh, God first. Wife. Kids. Work church ministry that's the way god set it up anyway all right so marketing your business is the video today i had a call i've done 13 estimates today it's three o'clock i'm heading to i got two more wide open going to them uh, we got a call and every estimate i pull up on this was a painting estimate. So first thing here, I'm Philip Mackins. Here's my card. Uh, how did you get my number? It's always my first question. They said, well, our roofer gave me another number or another guy's name. So I Googled him and the only thing that stood out was you had 135 five-star reviews. So three years ago, my wife talked me into going through the whole process of being a Google certified contractor. So we did that whole thing. It took like three weeks, you know, to get finally certified in it. And since then, we've got 135, 134 or something, uh, five-star reviews. So this lady got referred to somebody else. And because of our Google reviews, she called us. She still hasn't called that guy because his Google reviews were not two star. So I don't do Google ads. I only do Facebook ads. Right or wrong, that's what I that's what works for me. Uh, we try to we've got a strong following on Facebook. So that's the key is knowing your sweet spot and staying in it. And our sweet spot <clears throat> is small commercials and residentials. That's my sweet spot. Painting, only residential. Soft washing, I'll do anything commercial and residential. But getting the reviews and the recognition out there where people know that you are a reputable contractor. Let other guys price stuff what they price stuff. You know what you got to have to operate your business and pay payroll and workman's comp and general liability and all these things that go into a legitimate business. Like everybody's not legitimate. So make sure you advertise you are legitimate. And get if you're not legitimate, get legitimate as soon as possible. Uh, it, just, it just gets you way further than if you're not legitimate. Because uh, a lot of people ask, it just eliminates you from these big commercial jobs where you got to have, you know, two or three million dollars worth of insurance. I mean, you're eliminated. So I just wanted to encourage y'all today, stand out from the competition. Uh, keep pushing, man. If you're just starting out, you'll get legal soon. You know, you'll get reputable soon. So. The reviews are coming. Just be patient, bro. Just keep doing the next right thing. Every day, do the next right thing. I got some killer videos that I'm fixing to put out, man. And y'all let me know in the comment section, bro. It's going to be like stuff about marriage, man. Like, that I'm an idiot, dude, that I struggle with sometimes. With, you know, because I'm an idiot with my wife sometimes, bro. And, you know, I've got a group of guys, man. We all talk about it. But a lot of guys, man, don't talk about stuff like that. And you got to talk about it, bro. You got you to gotta get it out. 
So I'm gonna be putting out some stuff. It might go well, it might not go well, but I'm just gonna be really transparent of uh, the struggles in my life. You know, sometimes you gotta let your struggles out and uh, you get freedom from that. And well, I'm gonna start just posting some videos about that. And uh, y'all let me know if y'all wanna hear about it. If you don't, I'll quit posting. But uh, I think some people will get some freedom from it and become better men of God and uh, better husbands, better dads. You know, I text my wife this morning. I said, I just won the worst dad in the world award. And it's the voices in your head, guys, that you that you listen to, that you have to take into submission. That's a whole nother video. That's what I'm saying. I got so much in my head that I want to get out. Uh, I'm getting it out to my, my mentors and stuff like that. And uh, we're just going to keep going. But I'm going to run in here and grab me something to eat at 301. It's time to eat lunch. So... I got two more estimates. I hope y'all have a great day. Keep it pushing and subscribe to the channel, man. We really appreciate it. Hope y'all have a great day. Jesus loves you.